Kama Soko Kurukobo Yarano Kamo Kasuma Alia Alia Moaina Ankala Ankoa Sunkolo Yolo Kotoana Anda Katia Molumukuba Mankuba Kalambo Nunda Adina Kukunko Bosu Manala Amba Toro Yankla to Prando Kasuka Yalaida Kaso in Jesus' name. Beloved, I greet you all in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Still under the umbrella of Premier School of the Prophet. In our teaching today, we are looking at pro prophetic priority. I repeat, we are looking at prophetic priority. You see, spiritually speaking, you don't put the card before the earth. God has his own priority. If you are hearing from God, you know what God's priority are for your life. For instance, It is the Lord that order the way your life will go. It is the Lord that shire, shire is the Lord that reign the order of your life. And you need to make a priority what the Lord is making a priority in your life. Don't put the card before the horse. When they when when Samuel went to the to, to, to the house of Jesse, the Lord's priority in that house is David. And the Bible says, all the sons of David paraded themselves before Samuel. The Lord did not budge until David was brought from the, from the jungle, from the wilderness, where he was. And it was an, that was the Lord's priority. You need to know what the Lord's priority is concerning every area of your life, in your, in your, in your family. You need to know what the Lord's priority is. In your business, you need to know what the lost priority is. You must not put the card before the horse. A man said to Jesus, Lord, let me first go and bury my father. And the Lord corrected that. Don't say, you are placing your priority wrongly here. Let me first go and bury my father. He said, no. Let the dead bury their dead. Come and first follow me. God will not take the second position in anybody's life. Prophetic priority simply means highly putting high priority or putting high, uh, how will I call it now, how in, uh, putting great importance or what God is putting great importance in their order from the Lord, in their preference from the Lord. You see? Extreming what God is extreming and despising what God is despising or denouncing or disposing or discarding what God is discarding. I tell you, you need to walk in the spirit to be able to place your priority right. You must be able to place your... You must not put the card before the horse. You must allow the Lord to arrange your life the way it pleases him. The Bible says it did not take them through the shortcuts, through the way of the, because he knows they will see war. Instead, it took them through the long route. You need to place your priority right. You need to know what needs to come before what's in your life. I'm telling you, your life is not the same with anybody else's life. Your life is unique. You need to place high priority on whatever the Lord is playing high priority on. You cannot know that unless you walk in the spirit. You will not leave the substance for shadow. I say you will not leave the substance for shadow. I say you will not leave the substance for shadow. You will not leave God for gold. You will not leave God for gold. You place preference and priority on what the Lord is placing preference and priority. I declare, I declare the Lord will open your eyes. And your ears to see and to hear the Lord's priority. Zana! Concerning every area of your life, you place high priority on what the Lord is placing in high priority. Concerning every area of your life, in Jesus' name we are praying.